Hello, welcome back. Welcome to the course of Unix for testers. In this video, I'm going to show you a few uh, more commands uh, which can be used in Unix. Okay, so the very first one which I want to show you on the terminal. So, like in order to create a terminal, we use clear. But one shortcut I need, I want to tell you is instead of clear, what you can do is you can use Control L. It will create, it will clear basically a terminal for you. Okay, so fine. Now let us switch to our video where. I'm going to talk on some Unix commands like who am I, who, su, exit, add, user, su, and sudo. Okay, so let us start with the first one. So, my first command is who. So, who basically gives you the information about your username, your uh, date timestamp, and few other things. Okay, so the similar thing is if I use who. Basically, it will yeah, and if I use W, basically, it will give me the time from when my this. Okay, so basically, it gives me the more details like uh, from where I am connected, the CPU timing, idle time, logging in, my user. It gives you details like that. Okay, it also gives you from when your Unix server is up. Okay, how many users it is connected with, and other things. Uh, the important one is SU. So SU is basically used to switch to root user. Okay, so the current user which I am logged in is you can see here it is Prakash. Okay, so if you want to see what is your users, you can just click on users. So this particular users command will give you the and it is used to basically show the usernames of the user which are currently logged into current host. So currently I am logged in with my uh, username Prakash. Okay, now let us say I want to switch from Prakash to my root user. So I can use basically command cd. Sorry, it will ask me for password. Let me enter my password. And now you can see now I am logged in with root. Okay, so now I am with root user okay so that's it uh, that is basically su is used to uh, switch to basically your root user okay and if you want to uh, go back to your normal user exit from root user then you can use the command called as exit you will be directed to your user the previous one where you logged in right so that is basically your exit command okay and if you want to add the user so basically uh, you can use command like add user and then you can give username some username basically okay so it is saying add user command not found because add user is something which your admin should perform that is your root user should perform so the very first thing i'll switch to my root user using command su i'm typing my password okay now i'm at my root user and now i will use add user and i will give user one this time it is asking me to adding new user enter a new unix password for that particular user i am entering the unix password fine it is asking me to confirm few things if you want to enter otherwise just hit enter it will consider the default one information is correct yes and my now new user is created great so this is how you can use this command add user su i already talked uh, okay now let us say now i am into root user okay now let us say i want to change to my uh, user which is newly created which is my su user one so this basically su command if if you are passing the uh, particular username then I will get into that particular user. Yeah, so now you can see I am with logged in with user user one, right? So this is uh, you can use su followed by your username, okay? And if you want to switch to your uh, uh, again you to your normal user, then you will be using exit it will take you to root user and if you want to ex uh, exit again then you will get back to your the user where you logged in okay so this exit is basically used to go one level up okay so th this is how you can use this su command to switch to your root user as well and if you enter the username followed by su then it will 
take you to that particular account uh, and the final one is sudo okay so sudo is basically used to perform or execute any command with root privileges okay if you are not able to execute any command with uh, your account privileges then basically you can type any command like sudo and then the command which you are trying to enter so in my case let us say i am just trying to execute ls command but it is with sudo that is with admin privileges like in our windows like we do uh, start with uh, some something like start with admin run as administrators right so it's something like that it start with root privileges fine now uh, okay and if i want to see all the users okay so basically this users command as i said it will it will give you the list of uh, users which are currently logged into your unix server so my unix server with some host and i am the currently i am i'm currently only one user who is logged in that is what this users command gives but if you want to get a list of all users which are not even logged in currently but they are users of of your system then what you can do is basically uh you can get it from uh where it okay it is in etc slash give me a second so this cat command basically is used to display the information and i'm going to directory cat sorry etc and in etc we have some file password okay so if i use cat etc password it will give basically all the information along with all the users like aec underscore prakash is my user rsak is my user prakash is my user automation talks is my user user one is the newly created user Right, it will give all the information but it will give you some other information as well which i don't want okay so in that case what you can use is basically you can use the piping concept okay so let us say uh, i want the, the very first step i want to get this information and from this information output of this particular first command will act as a input to my second command and in my second command what i'm going to do is i'm going to cut up a specific portion okay and uh, i just i just want to get this uh, the the first one right and in this command sorry in this file you can see everything is separated by uh, colon okay so what i can do is i can use hyphen d which is basically used uh, to define a separator so my separator here is a uh, colon okay so hyphen d and uh, then i'll use a parameter uh, where i want to select my field so i will use hyphen f so this hyphen f is basically used to select your fields which column you want which field you want basically so i want my first field okay so i hope it is clear so cat etc password it will give me the output which you which which you are just seeing on the screen but out of this output i just want to extract cut only uh, the first column where it is separated with colon and now you can see the only first column and you can refer the last four or five rows where it is giving me all the users right so this is how basically you can get all the users for which you have the user account created on this particular host right so this is all about the unix command which i wanted to talk in this video thank you